Hi everybody, it's Elizabeth. Today we are going to be using our hands and our feet to make a parrot. So the things you're going to need, a piece of orange card, a piece of card any colour that you like, and a piece of white paper or light coloured paper, a pencil, scissors, a sticky eye, a glue stick, I've got a green and a brown crayon, paints, some water, a paintbrush and some baby wipes. You don't necessarily need baby wipes, but you might need a grown-up to help give your hands a wipe. Okay, so first of all, you're going to choose any colour of card you like and you're going to draw around your foot. So here is one I drew around and I cut out. So I am going to use the glue to stick my foot on to the card and I want it with the heel at the top of the page, okay? because the heel is going to be the parrot's face. Now I know that sounds a bit crazy, but I promise you will have a parrot at the end. So, I have drawn round my foot, I've cut it out, and I am sticking it on this page with the heel at the top, just like this, okay? I'm gonna actually move it over a little bit because we want to make sure we leave enough space for the wings. Then I'm going to take my sticky eye and I am going to stick it here. I'm going to cut a small section of orange card off. We just need a little square and again you know the drill by now, you pop it to the side and you keep it because you'll definitely need it later. So I am going to cut out a parrot beak shape and I'm going to glue that up as well okay I'm going to glue that one in the right place and by doing all of this it will make sure that we pop our hands in the right place so there we go we've got our foot for the parrot's body our beak and our eye. Then with the brown I am going to draw a branch that our parrot is sitting on. So just at the bottom I'm going to draw a nice branch that our parrot is having a rest on. Okay, it doesn't need to be perfect and the green I am going to give the branch some leaves. The parrot might want a snack, maybe he wants to have a snack on a leaf. Okay, you can do as many leaves as you like or maybe just one. It is his up to you. So there we are. Here is my parrot with his beak, his eye and his branch. Now I'm going to clear everything out the way because this might get a little bit messy. Sorry grown-ups. What we are going to do now is we are going to paint our hands. So I'm taking, in fact, first of all I'm going to open my baby wipes because I'm going to need to be grabbing these. So they're ready for me. I'm going to dip my paintbrush in the water and I think the bottom part of my parrot wing is going to be blue so I'm going to put glue on and I am going to paint the bottom of my hand blue. This feels really ticklish. I hope you're not all laughing because it's so ticklish. Okay so now that I've got loads of paint on there I'm going to dip my brush in and give it a good clean. Okay and then I'm going to choose green, okay? Oh, I'm splashing everywhere. And I am going to paint my fingers green. Okay, I am making such a mess. So, now that my hand is blue, I'm going to quickly run over the blue again because it just looks like it's a bit dry. So I'm going to give it a bit of a wet. And then I'm going to pop it on and make a parrot wing. 
and then I'm going to go and do another one and if you think that it needs topping up so there's mine you can take your paintbrush and you can top up the colour you can just dab your paintbrush on and top up the colour if you think it needs it okay You can, of course, go back over your hand. So I'm going to wet this. And then I think I'm going to give my brush a little bit of a dry. Because I think that's why it's so runny. And then I'm going to go with the blue again. And I am going to paint my hand blue again. Just to make it a bit darker this time. And I am going to pop it in the same place. Yeah, that's better. So we're going to do it again. And we are going to make it nice and dark so that you can see it on the page. So lots of paint on your hand. And again, there we go. So now you've got a parrot. Oh, mine's got a little blue spot on his beak. That just makes him unique. So there we go. We've got a parrot with dripping wet wings of handprint, a footprint for its body. And you are all done. Well done, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Grown-ups, I'm sorry about the mess. See you next time. Bye.